Hello, ladies and gentlemen. What is this? A second cast? Back to back? Really? I don't know. It's weird. It's weird. We're playing on Snowy Drought. This is a customized version for the balance patch that they made. Um, they changed and moved some stuff around. They put the supplies on the right on this map. And what's interesting about this game is Vitam is actually ECA. What? Vitam and ECA? Did anybody see this before? No? Who saw this before? I mean, I remember watching it a few times. I remember I told him that he should definitely play ECA after Falcons were at it because I remember the only thing he didn't like about ECA was um, their artillery. He didn't like winter tracks at all. He thought they were very weak. And I was like, okay. You know, when we get a new one, you should play ECA. And he's like, okay. And then he never did it. And Lightman is like one of those guys who like, um, as much as people like to joke that he's like a hard army or easy army that dies in one technical, he he likes his faction. He likes to play Russian, okay? Like for years, <laughs> consistently, he's played that faction, right? I can't be mad at a guy for this. I would like these faction, you know, purists to be gone. Fuck your ethno fascist, you know, faction fascism. <laughs> Second truck not here on the left just yet for vitamin, but SCG has a uh, action. Is he actually missing the truck as well? Why are these players missing their trucks? Is he getting it? We'll see. Um, they're trying. These guys are trying to kill a guard tower, like a nine with the conscripts. You need like ten conscripts to even actually threaten this guard tower. Okay, there we go. That's captured. One thousand dollars in the bank. Uh, this oil is going to be captured too in just a second. Warhounds out on the field, and Warhounds are the best unit ever. This, uh, this, oh wow, this Dozer's taking the hits for those beautiful puns, and now he's gonna go back and get repairs. No, he's gonna get a guard tower up getting repairs on the on the side. Damn, man. A good day to be a do to be a Panzer Faust, you know, this Dozer is working out for you really well. Okay, there we go. Hmm. So we're gonna see a gun tree get built over here. Is that truck still built? No, that truck is not built. Is this truck built? No, this truck is not built. These players are both dum dums right now. This truck is not built yet here. So there's two trucks missing here. So actually, STG is on free supplies technically. Meanwhile, Vitamin is on two and a half supplies. Yeah. Okay, uh, we're gonna get the refinery captured with this engineer, I think. There's a nice amount of guard towers, another uh, barracks over here, so you can feel the fortification probably. Sky Shield in the front lines, because this man, he wants to kill the uh, aircraft first and the infantry second. Okay. That Panzerfaust is gonna get gunned down. No, <gasps> no way it survives. He's like, even fuck you, wait, Panzer, please. Please don't pick that fight. Panzer, don't. You're too young, Panzerfaust. Please get back. It's gonna build. It's gonna build. No. Johnson. Oh, wait, no. It was, um, you need a German name. German name. German name. Uh, uh, German name. German name. Google German name. German male names. I, I don't want to use Hans. It's too. Carl. Yeah, that was just Carl. Okay, RPG Tower and Cash Center here because. The guy built a um, deployment zone, I guess. That's technically a reason. Is he capturing this back? I love this. It's like that island between Norway and like um, Canada that every year they send like the naval forces to go like plant their own flag to the beer for the next guy and go back. And he does like every year or something. And that's a good urban legend I heard from the internet. I don't know how true it is because it sounds kind of too chill for me, honestly. Okay, that guy is dead, but this BMP is not gonna be. Yeah, he needs to repair this quickly. Quickly, tech repair base, save him! He's not gonna die. Okay, is anybody inside it? An engineer. Oh no. Oh wait, that's a. That was a what? A Pons? That's a. F Panzerfaust, yeah, that's a Panzerfaust. Okay. Oh, mortar tracks are out though, but no balance for just yet, so we'll see how useful these are against these bombardiers. But bombers don't have any upgrades too, so I don't know. It's a tier 1 fight, but if these guys get a canister around, like the bombers are gonna get really fight. Oh, they got medkits, thank god. Medkits are stupid at this even stuff. Okay, another turret built on the left, because STG knows that if Rush is gonna win, they definitely need to build more turrets. They are the turret faction after all.
Hellion coming in from the left, but the Skyshots are there. He's be careful. One of these. Oh, wait, Hellion does not die. Oh, wow. Thank God there's no revolver rounds. But no, the Tiger does engage, but then just goes back. Schrodinger is a. Schrodinger? Schrodinger? I can't pronounce that. The Phantom Grumble, you know, it, it exists in quantum theory. The S300 either exists or doesn't exist. And for this guy, you know, this helicopter is either dead or not, but he doesn't know either. To him, it might exist or might not exist. It might be just an illusion. Who knows? More turret pushing on the left, because, you know, that's what we want to see as viewers. We want to watch your turret pushing. Yeah, these bombers are going to have a nice time. Tier 2, is it up yet? Yes, it is. So Grumble should be out. Um, did he get his... Yeah, he, he didn't get a second supply. This guy is... He got struck. Oh, why am I going to struck? Yes. This guy won one truck, so it's basically two and a half supplies against three supplies, so that's not that bad. Brute forcing uh, crash downs with Tiger, but not a good idea. Defenses and riser reds are ridiculously stacked, you know, armored against jet missile or aircraft, man, so not worth your time. Are those heavy snipers? Yes, they are. Wow. That's a heavy snipers. That's a rare unit to see. Especially because you need like two or three hits to kill one of these bombardiers. Nice. Oh, there's two of them. There's more of them. Can he kill actually. Okay, he can actually do some damage without getting killed. Okay. And anyway, they trade equally, right? Like, where did Frank go? There he is. Okay, Vyman's like, hello, SDG. Can I take a loan? No? Okay, I'll just do a direct withdrawal then. There he goes. 2000. Does he even have uh, conscript detection goggles, so. I don't know. Yeah, this grenadier all by itself can probably kill this. Yeah, wait, did you attack the guy in the back? You attacked the felon? There's a grenadier there. SDG, your tactics knows no bounds. You are okay. You can like steal more money. Detection tower? Are you for real right now? Are you gonna wait for this tower to build and then upgrade? Rather than sell this? Or you could just send a few conscripts? No? You could bombard it with Gorgons and see if you get lucky? That could also work, no? Like, goddamn, man, why do you... Why are you Russia players like this? Why do you even play Russia at this point? Like, just go play, you know, ECA? Look at this over micro. I don't get these guys over micro at all. Is he playing with like up down? Maybe. What do you, what are you saying? We have the we have the we have the uh, we have the specialist here, Mr. MP3. Do you think STG is playing like this? Just explain it. Hmm. Uh, what do you, what exactly do you mean? Yeah. You know, do you think he's playing on chess mode because the, like his movements are a bit? Ah. Uh, no, it probably isn't the case. I mean, I, I don't think that's the case. We can watch it, we can check the gentle later then. Okay, oof. That is risky. I mean, you know what's the, what's the thing can be? It's probably the mice or something like that, if you know what I mean. The ODX style thing, yeah. Ooh, that was a good hit. I mean, that was a bit of a dumb thing. I would have taken these garrisons and done some damage with that. Maybe just like, kill this guard tower, or no, kill the gun turret and then go in for it? Yeah. I mean, his Boris was an RPG one, so that wouldn't have done anything. Yeah. Alright, one, give me a second. Alright. Oh, 10 here coming out. He's gonna. Oh, he has the lion. The lion will allow him to beat both of these, right? Like, he could take this fight. He's just lost a helium for nothing. STG, I diagnose you with pussy. Because that's what you have. That's not what you get. Howitzer's coming in, gonna kill those two dozers, because, you know, fuck your dozers. Yeah. Yeah, fuck your other dozer too. Yeah, correctly. Fuck off. That must be VDV, right? That's VDV rank one. That's pretty good. That's Frank Diego. Oh, Frank here is attacking. Oh, that's great. Can you get him? <laughs> that was a perfect shot. That was right in the face. Oh, God. 
The Kodiaks are out of skill, I'm not sure why, but he has Kodiaks, that's cool. Maybe you can use the missiles, yeah, the missile gun has any of those. Okay, can you kill the whole tank? I'm not gonna kill the heavy snipers with Kodiaks, that's not gonna happen. But can't run them over either, and these grenadiers are going to clean you up. Alright, STG needs some more experience with the game. I'm making fun of it, but I think he does need more experience where he needs to remember things. I, I like that he knows at least the one thing of Teslas are bullshit, so he always uses Teslas in every game. Like, are there infantry problems? Tesla. Are there helicopter? Are there uh, tank problems? Tesla. Are there building problems? Tesla. Defenses? Tesla. Is there a jet problem? Tesla his airfield. Go on, go next year to Tesla the Jets. Tesla's fix everything. God damn, I sound like a fucking Elon Musk shill right now. <laughs> now, fun thing is, the Tesla tank is equal. Everybody dies in one hit, regardless of what faction, what unit, what veterancy, armor, but anything. Anything that gets touched by Tesla is dead. We do see two more uh, aircraft going in. I think there's a trash drop coming in. Yeah, there we go. I think Vyman doesn't understand what talent work is yet. Does he have the, he has the upgrade? He doesn't know how to use it. This isn't Boris, man. <laughs> uh, good try, my man. Good try. He, yeah, that's that's what's about it. God damn. What was this? Something died here. The Euro two European vehicles died. Is that mortar strike? I don't know. How much is it more and more? Jackman was losing the field, though. I mean, you could just spam RPGs against this. Oof. Solar burst in four minutes. Countdown has begun. There's gonna be more buildings in the middle. I don't know how it's a sky shield. Hmm, SCG is lagging in the economy, in the economy department. You did get a lot of those supplies. There's two supplies right now. Two against three, and then there's like two oils, which is like. Does he both have both oils? Yeah, they do. Actually, never mind. They're equal on the oils. So 10% discount. No, that's 10%. No, wait. Just repair path and one is supply. That's the advantage of it. But, yeah, yeah. yeah. Losing, losing the Gorgon for a gun turret is kind of strange. I do understand losing Buggy's gun turrets because like gun turrets are still in range and Buggy's are just Buggy. <laughs> Funny. <laughs> Alright, that's my strike force. Nice air, anti air. Wait, you don't have any. I just hit some grumbles in the back, but nah. Was this a grumble? No, there's no grumbles there. And these helicopters can't attack the air. Thank God, though. Can you imagine air to air helicopters? Write down in the comments if you want to see something like that. All right. Yeah. Uh. Let's see. That stencil is having a bad day, man. That was a good amount of falcons there, too. But you didn't get to kill two of the mortar tracks. I think maybe three of them? Because that is his goal, and he is doing well on that. It's just like STG just lacks a proper eco right now. Like, does he have any trucks outside of his? No, he doesn't. He didn't even. He lost a truck here. I don't know how he did that, but he just did, and it's still here. What's the commando truck? If it was a full bike, it would probably die by now. I mean, it would probably kill this. I don't know. Don't forget that unless you're against USA, Bulldog, uh, what's that? I mean, Bloodhounds are basically overpriced technicals, unless you're against USA. Or GLA, yeah. Against GLA, those things are tanky as fuck, and let's go for more others. Oh, we have a VDV drop coming in. Nice, nice, nice. And the front line's there, though? I don't, I don't agree with this one. I will drop them here, maybe. And just you know, make sure I grumble, like, attack for uh, attack here in the middle and just kill this or just kill one from here. I guess a guard attack can be issue, but yeah. 
Ooh. I think I heard a voice and then the voice just stopped firing. So is, he, is that voice? I don't know. Is he deploying these Falcons? Yeah, he's deploying this one. That's good. Deploying means more rate of fire and more um, range. Yeah, not damage range. You gotta get some damage with the uh, projectiles upgrade there. Plus around. More trash dropped in. Howitzer is still firing. Wotans are attack going into, you know, into a good place. Is he gonna go for heroic now? He is. Why are you going into the. Uh, don't go into their range, dude. You're gonna, you're gonna get out of range. Wow. So, wait. Killing a heroic Wotan and uh, killing a heroic Hellion and then two more helicopters just makes it a little. That's a high requirement. Anyways, SDG has called the GGs. You have I, I mean, this seems like a pretty basic playstyle. It feels like Vitamin can be a good Russia player. He doesn't see the small nuances, but he gets a basic concept, and with that he was able to secure a good victory. STG did a nice amount of mistakes, but I don't know, I feel like this was balanced enough. Balanced enough to share the replay. Like, usually I don't really uh, like, like bashes. You know, like, one-sided games, I really don't like them. That's why you should never see them on my channel. If there is any telling me, I will remove them, because I, I do cast some of the games, I'm like, eh, maybe, maybe not, but yeah. All right, well then, thank you for watching, everybody, and I will see you on the next cast. See you later.